Hi, I am Dr. Neha Mishra. I work as consultant infectious diseases at Manipal Hospital, Bangalore. Once the patient, uh, uh, um, you know, develops this disease, uh, they can be uh, infective to others, and they can be infective to others as early as four. Uh, days prior to development of symptoms also so we have to be make sure that pay, the high index of suspicion should always be there in case of any travel or any contact with somebody who already has the disease the diagnosis of uh, a monkeypox is actually through a dna testing which can be done through the secretions and uh, this dna identification is done at specific centers which are uh, identified in government by government and uh, after uh, identification of the virus the treatment is mostly symptomatic apart from that there are antiviral like tecovirimat and sidofovir which are available which can be tried to prevent the disease there are vaccines like acam 2000 and uh, mva these vaccines are are uh, the availability of these vaccines in all part of the world are, is still an issue so th with this statement that who has released recently in august second week the uh, they have also requested to uh, you know ramp it up the vaccine production so that uh, it becomes easy to deal with the disease it's very important to take travel history properly. It's important to examine the patient, look at all skin uh, and mucosal surfaces to ensure that uh, the smallest of lesion is also not missed uh, because they can later spread and become more. Also, it's very important to uh, having a high index of suspicion and sending the testing makes it easier for us to diagnose and manage the patients better. In case of any queries or any suspicion, regarding the disease, you can always visit the nearest healthcare facility and seek help. Uh, taking the right kind of medical advice at these times will be very helpful.